The Zambia National Farmers Union, ZNFU, has appealed to government to enhance irrigation farm in rather fund in view of climate change. ZNFU President Javis Simba says climate change is real and causing drought, which is lessening food production. Mr. Zimba says as the country commemorates Farmers Day today, farmers must remember to be innovative and diversify within the sector. We have more. 27-year-old Emmanuel Ndlovu is a trained banker but decided to venture into agriculture. Mr. Ndlovu, who was job hunting four years ago, saw opportunities in agriculture. The young farmer who has been farming for four years now is producing 1,500 heads of cabbage and 140 boxes of tomatoes a day. It, it is actually a profitable business and it will actually help youths out there to stay away from other negative vices such as drinking and you know things that won't actually add value to, to, to the economy. So if you take on farming it will actually help uh, improve not just the, the economy but also uh, sustain you because it is a sustainable business and uh, it is actually a viable business that uh, anyone can actually take on. Government has been calling on young people to seize opportunities in the agriculture sector and create jobs for themselves. Meanwhile, Agriculture Minister Michael Katambo says government is committed to ensuring inputs are delivered on time for the 2020-2021 agriculture season. We'll ensure the nation remains food secure both during and post COVID-19. The measures we have therefore put in place are aimed at ensuring the country's food supply, both from outside Zambia and within the country, is not disrupted. Zambia National Farmers Union President Javis Simba has called for innovative solutions in the agriculture sector. The issue of climate change is real, so we have got to invest in irrigation. The country commemorates Farmers Day every first Monday of August. Etambuyu Katota, ZNBC News, Lusaka. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, leave a comment, and subscribe.